I mean, I know I'm gonna try and go. Me, I know what I'm in. Trust me, I mean, I know, I know. My mind, you can never be happy because tonight would have been the night of like people just yelling at each other because of the emotion. Yeah, yeah, that would be something like I want to connect with people who are over. Go on, sleep, baby. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. As usual, your narrator is here from Pop with Lillian. And guys, tonight's revelation shocked me. Because <laughs> I know the word that was saying um, Jenny O betrayed Yvonne. Meanwhile, Jenny O is saying she's angry with Yvonne. I mean, I was not wondering, how will you be angry with somebody that you're literally over? her friend Abby man I don't know the right word to use because Yvonne is clearly saying she's not in anything serious with Juicy J but even though even though why will you Jenny O of all people meanwhile but what Jenny O is saying tonight because when um Yemi and Kosi were having their issues and Miracle came to Jenny O Jenny O opened up said that she's very angry with Yvonne that she had an agreement with Yvonne and what she saw tonight surprised her. So she said she and Yvonne had planned to play games with Juicy J. But then she saw them kissing tonight and she says Yvonne should have told her she has feelings for Juicy so she could back off instead of flaunting it in her face. Me, I was now saying, even if they were both playing games, you saw your friend kissing him and you feel she has feelings for him, why not back off? Meaning you have feelings for him as well and you kept to yourself. You get because if he, had it been she doesn't have anything in mind, seeing them you would think, oh, maybe the game is still on. But what it li literally shows is that yourself, you're beginning to develop feelings for this guy. <laughs> Know how to hide? I don't know how to hide my ex I don't know how to hide my emotions. I don't know how to hide how. Meanwhile, Olivia has already briefed Juicy J that um, Jenny O is feeling you're putting her in a triangle with Yvonne, and then Juicy J decided to go and meet Jenny O to clarify the whole assumption she has regarding him. Olivia herself says she would, she could have talked to Jenny O, but she herself she has her own problem, and she's already tripping for Tabang, and with the fact that she's asking herself why would she be falling for a small boy? In fact, she kept on telling Juicy J that she doesn't know why that anytime she wakes up in the morning, Tabang is the first person she lays her eyes on. Today I asked her, should I oil your body? He said no. Okay, should I get there, you, uh... So before Jenny O had a conversation with Juicy J, she first of all had a conversation with Yvonne and Yvonne telling her that why she doesn't want to get serious with anybody in the house is that she wants to go out to watch the whole show and then be sure that it wasn't a game for you. Yvonne went ahead to tell her that even Juicy J, she wants to just keep it on the friendship level till maybe probably outside of the house that even at that she knows that there are so many guys out there waiting for her outside the house and even if something will definitely happen between her and Juicy J it will be when the show is over she will go home watch and be sure that all this why Juicy J wasn't playing her or probably maybe he had someone else in the house and it was just a strategy for him as if that wasn't enough with Jenny because she made some comments. Jenny's attitude does not match that she agrees with what Yvonne is explaining. Meanwhile, Juicy J took um, Jenny O out where he first of all apologized if he created a wrong impression and then went ahead to clarify Jenny that there is nothing between the both of them and I don't think this syncs well with Jenny O because after that she went back to Nana to rant about the whole that she feels she has been played 
by juicy j and yvonne that she felt they just you know betrayed her they, they, they both of them maybe even planned this just to make a joke out of her honestly i would like to know the drink the housemates had in their pool party because all this clarification you can't tell me they all happened in clear eyes like tonight everybody was trying to clarify this person was trying to you know i believe there must be something in that drink anyways meanwhile jp and mavin seems to be getting along as the both of them were just outside having the best time of the evening I'll be waiting for all your opinion and view about this whole triangle matter in the comment section. Feel free to tell me what you think about any of the housemates. See, drop your comments, okay? Opinion is free. And I'll see you in my next video. Please, if you enjoyed watching this, if you enjoyed listening to me, please give this video a thumbs up. Like this video, share if possible. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done that. And if you have subscribed, turn on your post notification bell. So anytime I make a new video, you will be updated. Thank you for watching and I appreciate you coming to my channel. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.